Hi, today we have food and drink vocabulary set with 175 words and phrases on the topic. The food we eat may be delicious, tasty, appetizing, yummy, or tasteless, awful, revolting, disgusting. Fruit and vegetables can be ripe, fresh or freshly picked, as well as preserved, pickled, marinated, canned. Examples of popular fruit are an apple, a peach, a pear, strawberries, cherries, a pineapple, a banana, a melon, a pomegranate, a plum, grapes, an avocado, an apricot. And some vegetables, a potato, a cabbage, peas, a carrot, an eggplant, an aubergine, a zucchini or in courgette, a turnip, a beetroot, cauliflower. When we talk about meat, the food words are different from the animal words. For example, a pig is the animal word and pork is the food word. In the same manner we have cow, beef, young calf, veal, sheep, lamb. Ham is made from different types of meat and one common word for the meat of domestic birds, such as chickens, ducks and geese, is poultry. People who do not eat meat but include dairy or milk products such as cheese, cream and butter and eggs in their diets are called vegetarians. Vegans eat neither meat nor dairy and eggs. The most popular fish and seafood are salmon, trout, mussels, tuna, squid, lobster, caviar, prawns, snapper, crab, clam. To add special taste and flavor to food, we use herbs such as parsley, fennel, coriander, basil, dill, lemongrass, bay leaf, rosemary, caraway seeds. Let's take a look at some useful phrases. If you're really hungry, you can say, I'm starving. If milk, meat, fish, fruit is not fresh, you can say, it's off or gone off. Don't drink this milk, it's off or it's gone off. If bread is not fresh and has become dry, it is stale. For example, I bought the bread only yesterday and it's already stale. If you have eaten enough and do not want any more food, you can say that you are full. Everybody knows how we call meals. Breakfast, lunch, dinner, supper. We usually have dinner in the evening and supper is a really light meal that a lot of people don't even have. However, when we use these words with some verbs, there are certain things that are important to know. We usually say have breakfast, lunch, dinner, supper without an article, but we do use the indefinite article when adjectives are added. Have a large breakfast, a substantial dinner. We use preposition for in phrases like what do you usually have for dinner or I had fish and chips for lunch. Do you sometimes have a snack? A snack is a small amount of food that is eaten between meals and it is not considered healthy to have lots of snacks. Talking of which, there are more words and phrases to say if food is healthy or not. So healthy food is also organic, natural, fresh, low fat. Food commonly viewed as unhealthy is processed, fast food, also known as junk food, fattening food that literally makes you fat. People who want to lose weight or just become fitter and healthier may stick to a diet or be on a diet. They eat fat-free products with low levels of salt and carbohydrates. There are different types of diet, but a general recommendation is that it should be well balanced. Words to describe food. Sour, sweet. When you say the food is savory, it means salty and spicy. Blunt is the synonym of tasteless. Also, it can be crispy, dry, tender. How do we cook food? You can fry it in a frying pan, boil it in a saucepan, stew in a pan or in a pot. Roast on a baking tray and use the same tray to bake things in the oven. You can also roast things on the open fire. We steam food in a pot, a skillet or a pan, but there is also an electric appliance that can be used for that purpose called a steamer. Please do not confuse it with a type of sheep that has the same name. 
A lot of people like grilled food that is cooked on a grill, a metal frame put over a fire. This thing is used a lot for barbecues. When cooking, we perform certain manipulations. For example, you can squeeze a lemon, beat or whisk eggs, peel potatoes, slice bread, grate cheese, stir a mixture, chop vegetables, melt chocolate, grind coffee. Let's see what else you can do with some popular products. Eggs can be boiled, fried, scrambled, poached, which means cooked in or over boiling water. Potatoes can be roast, fried, boiled and then mashed. People also cook jacket potatoes, which are baked with the skin on. Deep-fried potatoes are called French fries or just fries in the USA and chips in the UK. A steak can be rare, medium or well done. And salmon can be smoked, poached and salted. A recipe is an instruction, often a written one, of how to make a certain dish. It includes some peculiar phrases that are good to know. When cooking something, we often add a tablespoon or a teaspoon of sugar or vinegar, a piece of something, for example parsley, a pinch of something, for example salt or pepper. Also, talking of small quantities, we can say a sprinkle of something. For example, a sprinkle of pepper or a sprinkle of ground nuts. Finally, let's talk about drinks or beverages. They can be alcoholic and non-alcoholic. Alcoholic drinks are called liquor and in the UK spirits. Non-alcoholic drinks are known as soft drinks or soda in the USA. Some popular alcoholic drinks are beer, ale, wine, sherry, champagne, whiskey, cognac. By the way, champagne and cognac are brand names and can be used only if the drink was produced in certain parts of France. Soft drinks, Coke and Pepsi, they are brand names as well, but now are often used as household names. You can also drink lemonade, juice, tonic, coffee and tea. If you go to a bar or a pub, you can order different types of beer, such as lager, ale, dark, stout or filtered beer. This is all for today. I hope this video was useful and if you think so, please leave your thumbs up and comments below. And if you have any questions, please write them also in the comments. I'll be happy to answer them. Goodbye!